again and today we're going to show you how to make folded paper leaves that you can turn into a fall mobile or wall hanging. For these leaves you'll need construction paper in autumn colors, a pair of scissors, glue or double sided tape, depends on what you have, yarn, and a stick from outside. A pencil or ruler will also be helpful. Let's get started. To make the leaves the size we want, we'll use half a sheet of construction paper. So you'll need to measure the length of your paper and cut it in half. If you don't have a ruler, you, you can uh, fold your paper in half, unfold it, and cut along the crease. Now our paper is the right size, but we need to make it in the right shape. But to do this, fold your paper in half. This folded edge will be the, edge will be the center of your leaf, so don't cut it. There are a few different ways to cut your paper. Each will give you a different shape. The easiest way is to cut a diagonal line from one corner to another. To make a pointed leaf like a maple, cut a shape like the half of a Christmas tree. And for a wavy leaf like an oak, try cutting a wavy line. You can see all of these shapes travel from one corner to the diagonal corner. To help with tracing, you can try cutting the, some templates from recycled cardboard. shapes, we open our paper up. You can see that every shape has a wide end and a narrow end with our crease in the middle. Now it's time to fold the paper into leaves. Starting at the wide end, we're going to do an accordion fold all the way up to the narrow end. Accordion folds are easy, but they may take some practice. First fold, a fold over a narrow strip of your paper, then turn the pa your paper over. Make another arrow fold up about the same width as your first. Keep going back and forth, folding strips. See how the paper gets shorter? Folded up. Tie a piece of yarn around the center. Make the knot on top of the narrow end. Leave a long tail on your yarn. That's how we'll attach it to the mobile. Once the yarn is tied and the center is secure, we'll finish the leaf by folding this long end to this long end. We'll keep it together using double-sided tape, but you can use glue or a glue stick to glue the edges together. Once you've got your leaves made, tie them at different lengths to your stick using the long tail of yarn. If you have a paper punch, you can try tying the leaves together. Don't forget to add a piece of yarn tied on each end of the stick to make a loop to hang from your, your mobile from. We had lots of fun making leaves in all kinds of fall colors to welcome September. We hope you had fun making them too and celebrating the beginning of autumn. Until next time, bye!